and welcome back to my youtube channel in the last video we have talked about how to import the iris dataset using cmon library and checking some of the basic functionality like null value and how to check the header part how to check the sample value how to check the description part and in this tutorial we're going to learn about how to do train and stress splitting and in the upcoming videos we will know more about how to plot graph we will talk about different graphs so in this video we will more focus about how to do train and test splitting many of the people got confused how to do the train and test split so let's do the modeling and in after this video i will talk about how to apply a basic uh, algorithm that's called logistic regression by using sklearn so yeah in next video we will learn about logistic regression in this video we will learn about how to do the train and test split so in the uh, we have given taken two variable that is one x and one is y so in the x variable we have just dropped the column species so what's the basic species is so in order to do so what i will do i will just try to print a df here for you guys I'll print df okay run anyway okay let me do so and it's showing error because i have done here i have not run this command here so let me import again and it is showing that i have not import okay sorry i have not uh, run this command then after that uh, i will try to load my data set and yeah it's ready now you have learned about this thing now i will try to print the data set here in front of you so that you can get a clear idea so yeah it's you can see here we have something called sepal length sepal width petal length petal width and species so yeah i am trying to drop the species so we are trying to drop this part because this is the part we are, we are going to predict so yes we are trying to drop this part and x is equals to 1 so this row column is called as x is equals to 0 and this column and this uh, column part is called x is equals to 1 so you don't have to worry about that in order to in order of 1 you can type column also it will work so yeah in the y column we are trying to store df uh, comma species we are trying to store uh, this part in another variable and we are trying to print the shape so as you can see here in the x in the x variable we have this whole data set and in the y variable we have only this species data set if i if i have to show you what's what's inside the y so if i print y here in front of you so so here y is not defined okay let me okay i have not run this command till now i have run here and let me and this uh, here you can see here we have uh, satosha satosha here all the species are there so here we have splitted this part okay successfully and the next part we are trying to focus more on this this line let's see this line from sklearn dot model selection we have to import train and test split this is the basic module from the sklearn module we are trying to import this functionality called train test split so what we will do x train x test y train y test equals to train test split x comma y these two variables we have to give here this x and y variable and this will show that uh, test size how much test size you wanna give and it will take the random state as like it will take random variables so yeah let let me print it again so if we will shift and enter we'll press shift and enter so yeah i have not imported i'm sorry for that yeah let me import it first and that let me done it so now you can see here uh, we have done successfully done the train and test split so uh, you can see here we have x train having 90 comma 4 so in uh, like let me see how my train and test data looks like so if i want to see uh, my how my train data like if i want to print x dot x train x train look like this and it has taken 90 comma 4 and and again if you want to see like a uh, white train so in order to do so you have to follow the same command add a new column like if i want to white train and uh, if i want to print this part shift enter and it will show me what are the white trains values are there okay and in the y uh, in the y column as i have told you y is something called species so y y variable we have to predict it and the x value is something that we need to give the model in order to train the model so yeah and w if people are wondering why i have splitted the data as train test so so do so like i will try to write a very simple comment so there is something called uh, train data set you have something called train data set in order to do so you have to first of all you have to give the train data set to the model what you have built the model and then the model 
will use the that train data set in order to produce test okay I'm sorry for that test data set so what's this mean you have to train your model by using train data set and that train data set and then after that you have to test your model right how you uh, read throughout the semester and at the end of the semester you have to give the exam for this subject particular subject so it's the same for the model here so yeah uh, in the next video I will try to talk about how to apply the logistic regression and how to uh, how much percentage accuracy we will get so yeah if you enjoyed this video give us a thumbs up and meet you in the next video thank you and have a nice day bye